Hi everyone, and welcome to Armour Krog. Uh, this is a game that I have been meaning to play for so long. I actually backed it on Kickstarter way back when it was on Kickstarter, trying to get its funding up. Uh, it's from the brain of Doug Tendapo, who made some fantastic creations, but most famous, let's be honest, for Earthworm Jim. Uh, absolute pop culture icon in the 90s and one of my absolute all-time favorite Mega Drive uh, Genesis games um, so yeah and then as I backed it and more and more information started coming out and I found out that Rob Paulson is going to be is, is one of the voice actors in this he's one of my all-time favorite voice actors I mean some people might just think Rob Paulson and think Fight Club his name is Robert Paulson but to people like me in the, the 90s generation of child um, he's uh, Yako Warner from Animaniacs, okay? So, I could geek, geek out all day about this, but I just want to get into this game. It's, and it's claymation based. It's claymation game, uh, much like uh, Ten Nipples earlier stuff, um, which makes it even more exciting. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hop right in here. Oh. No. Every game needs to start with a musical number. I've decided every single game needs to start with a song. <laughs> okay, okay, Beak Beak. I'm just glad we're still alive. Yeah, me too. Now, let's get a look at the hall. Insurance is gonna cover this. Our deductible is nuts too. Big big. Look at that. What do you make of this guy? <laughs> Ooh, an arm leg. <laughs> oh. Howdy. This guy ain't friendly. <laughs> what the <laughs> what does that talk to? <laughs> Well, sorry, that dog-like creature. Oh. Nice. Oh, okay. That's interesting. <laughs> the angry eyes. <laughs> it's like an intestine with eyes. <laughs> Yeah, let's just go in then. Yeah. Beaky, what is this place? Got me. Okay, time to do some logic puzzles. Cause this is what this game's about. Okay, uh, claymation based logic puzzle game. So, okay, I guess this. Is an obvious starting point. That's so weird. He keeps things in his chest cavity, but I guess he's made it clear so he can just stick stuff in there. I like it. It's unique. So I guess do I? Yeah. Okay. Starting us off easy. 
They don't want to tax our brains too much straight off the bat, do they, to be honest? That looks like it should be an, ex oh, an entrance or something, never mind. Alright. What is that? Over there! It's like a little... Looks like a slice of cake. A furry slice of cake. Therefore, probably is not a good slice of cake. I don't think there's anything else to click on. Well, I guess you could click on the statue, but... Oh! Uh, I knew you'd come. You have travelled far, yet your true journey begins through the exit unseen. Through the exit unseen? Uh, can I talk to this dude? This Hoojit? Oh, I guess I just kind of push him out of the way. Oh, okay. So there's a button. A little tunnel. Oh, okay, I can just walk on over him. Can I not reach the light bulb? No. Can I push the button? What's that do? Okay, push it then. Or you could just walk into it, you know. There we go. Oh. Oh, can I go in this hole? Why can't I go in this hole? Why can't I go in this hole? Oh, beak he can. A big beak. Ah, you can. Oh, what's that one? What's that before? Woo, tripalicious. Woo. Okay, so you can wander off down here. Alright. I like the way they just throw you in. That's great. So not all games need to throw, like, give you a 10 bajillion year tutorial of how to figure stuff out. I'm cool with just diving in. Oh, wait a minute. Wait just a second. Wow, okay. So, I can't go through that door, but, okay. Right. Was that actually any use? Hmm. Huh. It was a cool little distraction, if nothing else. Let's get it back up here. Trot, 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 trot. Hmm. Okay, that was interesting. But what about that? Uh, all right. Okay, that does shut on me now. Alright. The soundtrack's pretty epic, I've got to say. Okay, what am I missing here? Why would I need to push him this way? This strange, cute creature. Oh, I keep pushing him. Any particular reason for that? Do I need to... Oh, where is that? Oh, pants. Okay, bear with me. We'll figure this out. Such a derp. I saw that spinny thing too. Do you just eat it? What the f what did that do? Wait, what was the uh, So I ate it for what? Okay then. Oh. Ah. Oh. Makes total sense. Hundred percent sense. Yep. Totally, totally cool. 
Yep. That's totally. Ooh, smells like bacon in here. Smells like bacon, looks like gammon. Alright. What have we got here? What's this? Oh, hi. Where? Oh, poop. I should have paid more attention, shouldn't I? Where? Okay. Two, three, and one. Uh. Oh, wait a second. Huh? <laughs> it's really just for the sound effects. Alright, I'm sure it's meant to. Okay, how do you back out of that? Let's. Okay, wait a second. Let's just. I don't get it. I don't get what he's trying to tell me. Two, three, and one? For what? Okay, I'm, 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 I'm getting a darn notepad. This, this game might require some deep thought, which I wasn't anticipating, but I'm not complaining about. Can I go further up? Oh, I can go further up. Okay. Oh, okay. Maybe I don't. Whatever happened here, it was not good. No, Gigi might be gaping hole in the wall. Uh, let's see, can I go explore? I guess there's not much to do here yet. I like the music, and I like the style. I've got to say, there's definitely something to this. I might keep going up to. How many floors are there? Oh, that must be it. Oh, yep, that will be it. There's his face. Is that one of Octo Dad's relatives up there? <laughs> so I can't obviously get over there. But I can go here. Oh, there's stuff. Let's pick this up. What is that? I can't do anything with it, I guess. I can't go in here yet either, I guess. No, I can't. No. No, that would be a no. But I've got some item though. Alright then. Let's go back down. Oh, no, no, that's all I meant to do. I meant to, there we go. Go down. And now can I down? Ah, it goes in here. There we go. Oh. Huh. Hmm. Okay. Did I hear a cow? I know the dog's got a penchant for cows. Okay, weird little machine, and it looks like more power is required. Oh wait, Beak Beak can probably go through here. Yes, there we go. All right, is this another thing where you can go and find a random item? Is that seemingly the point of most of these little corridors? Maybe? No, I can't see any squirrely thing this time. Okay, where's this taking us? Oh, up here. What good is that? Doesn't seem to be much good, to be completely honest with you. That this oh. Ah, 
Say out he knows Spirosum and not get to our Bruho Vala Ed. Don Ravet Ne, Thou Trot Arnakal. Don Reka Robert Up, Mark Anu Asa Vat Sinigan, Ne Uf Tum Nub, Ne Duty Vaxe, Ne Anakal Sultan Dal Jeff Seed, Nu Sifi Kaba Div, Ruvas Ed Al Se Mongo, Nakomi Div, Se Galiso, Ed Orta the Grillet, Ne Gidney Al Spirosnik, Ne Ula Nusha, Nus D and Vasiva. It looks all pretty and stuff, but I don't know what's going on. Thanks. Thanks, I guess. For that. Well, that, that was certainly something. Um, there's no denying that. Was it reversed? Is that like backwards? Interesting. May have to loop that back. Once Beak Beak's finished harking up this thing. Hurf! Nice. I, I, I have no idea. Oh, apparently it goes in here. Yes, apparently it goes in there. And does... Something? I don't know what it does though. Maybe we need to leave the room to find out what it quite... What it, what it did. Well, I'm just going to have a quick peek up the top here again and see if anything is changed. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Urgh. Okay, sorry. That was totally. <laughs> Alright, well. I have enjoyed fooling around with the intro here and starting to figure some stuff out, but I think... Oh, mate, wait a second. Uh, I, uh... Well, wait a second. Maybe I just need to... Oh, howdy. We have a ding. Oh, what does that mean? What does that do? Ah, oh, I keep forgetting. I just... Oh! Thanks, Beaky. That really helps. Oh! Yeah, you sit. Sit. Good boy. I mean, this is locked. Ah, let me. I'm not doing anything with it yet. But, but, but. Oh. Do I need somebody? Oh, wait a second. Oh, but I can't get there, can I? I bet it's been purposefully manufactured so that you can't get to it before it stops.
course not. No, it's just a silly idea. It's not going to work. So how the heck? Oh boy, this game's got me thinking. It's got my think gland working. So now I don't... Okay, well, I think... I think I would have stopped there for part one. Um, th that, it's different, isn't it? It's it's uh, it's gonna be a head scratch here, which is one thing I can sometimes be great at, but sometimes I can be a complete dum dum. So this might be a kind of have to. This might be one of those bear with stupid Michael while he tries to not be so stupid kind of deals. But if you if you're willing to put up with me being stupid every now and again, maybe we'll both get something out of this. Both as if there's one person, maybe we'll all get something out of this together. And maybe you'll be inspired to go and pick this game up yourself and give it a go. And maybe you won't be as stupid as I am. That's a possibility. So, you know what? I'm just gonna get back to the main screen and finish off here. But yeah, this is part one of Amber Krog. Um, I think I'll keep doing it. I think we'll, we'll get through this. Might be a bit, might be big, might be long, might not be long. Might and uh, maybe just need to shut up now, right? And um, please, <laughs> please like, share, subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed already. Uh, and yeah, feel free to check out my Facebook and Twitter links too down there in the description. And have yourselves a good morning, afternoon, evening, or night. I'll see you guys later. Bye.